asthma for years. A North Texas teenager who battled severe asthma for years is breathing free and clear tonight. Doctors used stem cell therapy to temporarily treat his severe asthma. They call it their newest tool for fighting severe breathing problems. Our health reporter Bianca Castro shows us how it works. Any activity came with risk for 18-year-old Kenton Crenshaw. It's been eight Christmases in the hospital because of asthma, and days or weeks long, birthdays, and it's just controlled my life, really. Managing his allergies and asthma. My oxygen levels is 96. Became a full-time job. I carry this one on me every day. And I keep my EpiPen on me every day. But still, his asthma would strike with no warning. Like two, three, four in the morning, it just hits me and I wake up and I freak out. Have you been using a steroid inhaler at all? Out of options, his family took him to Dr. Bill Johnson at Innovations Medical. Dr. Johnson is one of a growing group of doctors. Yeah, not hearing much on the right. Using stem cell therapy to treat various diseases. The stem cells have the ability to reproduce and to become other types of tissue, and that's what makes them so special. Dr. Johnson took a small amount of fat about the size of your thumb from Kenton and separated the stem cells in a centrifuge. Then the cells were mixed with a solution and pumped back into Kenton's body through an IV and breathing treatments. He has an overactive immune system in his lungs and the airways. And what the stem cells can do is turn that down, turn, decrease that amount of inflammation. And he's had a really remarkable course. Come here. It's been a few Come months here. since the treatments. I feel perfect. And Kenton yeah. hasn't touched many of his medications. Didn't do one breathing treatment in almost three months. And I used to do maybe four to six breathing treatments a day. A breath of fresh air for Kenton, now ready to jump back into life free of asthma. I hope I never have asthma attack <laughs> for the rest of my life. Bianca Castro reporting their treatments cost upwards of $7,000. They are not covered by insurance.